I'm proud to be their minister and of the bravery they showed throughout the event. Mr Speaker. No, I've indicated to the member that I will not call him when he is not properly dressed. The member will resume his seat. A point of order. Do Your you memo made to reference to those that have cultural attire. You have allowed other cultures to wear what's right for them. Why are you denying Māori culture their attire and his heitiki? The expression that is used in the standing orders is business attire. Uh, business attire is something on which I have consulted. Um, the members chose not to respond to the consultation. Uh, that, is, that is their choice. I have uh, been guided and will continue to be guided in these matters uh, by the views of members. I'm not absolutely required to do that, uh, but I do want to make it clear uh, that the significant majority of members who responded uh, made it clear that ties uh, were part of uh, business attire. Uh, and and um, we could have a long discussion on this, uh, and I have had it in my office with a number of members, um, and as I've indicated uh, at least twice to the House, uh, my own sympathies are with an abandonment of ties, uh, but that is not the view of members who responded. Supplementary question. Point of order. Uh, no, the member cannot take a point of order. The member cannot take a point of order. I do not recognise the member. He will now leave the chamber.